Genesis, I'm not Genesis, I'm sorry. I'm scatterbrained. Revelations 4. God is very angry for what's happening to his children. Very real and very black. Not white, not like this. This ain't God. God don't look like, God don't do like this and flow his hand in the wind. He don't do that stuff. That's homosexual. God don't do that. The Bible says God is a man of war. That's right. A real man. Now, watch what God, this is how, watch this. Read that. This is the book of Revelations, chapter 4, verse 2. Somebody get a jasper and a sardine stone. Read. And immediately I was in the spirit, uh -huh. and behold, a throne was in heaven, uh -huh. and one sat on the throne. So in heaven, he watches somebody sit in heaven. Read. This is God you're talking about. Read. And he that sat was to look upon on like a jasper and a sardine stone. So the person on the throne, being God, said, when I looked at him, he, he looked like a jasper or sardine stone. You tell me what a jasper and a sardine stone looked like. We're talking about God. You got it? Show him. Bible said God looked like that. So where we get this from? That's why we don't believe the Bible. The same people that taught you this taught you that God loved everybody. No, God loved these people because these people were made slaves. God looked like you and me. Christ looked like you and me. God got uh, Christ, God got Afro hair. Daniel seven. God got Afro woolly hair. Read. Got it. Get it quickly. Watch this. Read. This is the book of Daniel, chapter seven and verse nine. Read. And I beheld till the thrones were cast down. Read. And the ancient of days did sit. God is the ancient of days. He's older than time. So let's talk about God. Read. Whose garment was as white as snow. Read. And the hair of his head. And God's hair on his head. Like the pure wool. Like that baby hair. That's pure woolly That's hair. Right. God got hair That's like that. Right. So we just read in the Bible that teaches us God look like a white man. We just read in the Bible that God got an afro and black skin. And that his sons and daughters went into slavery for disobeying him. And their children were sold in slavery. That's why my man said, bro, that's crazy. It's crazy because you like, damn, that's true. And I didn't know it was in the Bible. How, how, all these, you've been to church a hundred times, right? Come on, bring it out. Why nobody ever showed you that? Right, bring it out. Why nobody, get, get, uh, 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 uh Psalms 83. I'm going to show you why nobody tells you that, but everybody got stores in your neighborhood because every race of people is envious of you. We hear all the time, everybody's a son of God. No, they not. Everybody God's children. No, they not. Because the same things don't happen to everybody. Right? right? Read. This is the book of Psalms, chapter 83 and verse 2. Read. For lo, thy enemy. Sorry, verse 1. Verse 1. Keep not thy silent. Keep not thou silence, O God. This is King David praying in the spirit. Read. Hold not thy peace. He said, don't hold your peace, God. Read. And be not still, O God. Read. For lo, for lo, thine enemy, your enemies, God, make a tumult. They angry and they gather together. Read. And they that hate thee, and they that hate you, God, read. Have lift up the head. Read. They have taken crafty counsel against thy people. They, hold on, hold on. These people that hate you, God, have taken crafty counsel against your people, God. Because they, they, they can hate God, but they can't go up there and do a dang thing to God. So how can they take the anger out on God? By taking crafty counsel, meaning, let's all get together. Hey, come here, come here. Everybody come here. How the hell are we going to destroy them? Bring it up. They doing too much. God favored them, and I don't like that. So what are we going to do to make them awful people? Let's, I got it. God said if they sin against him, he's going to curse them. Let's show them that sin is fun. Right. Instead of getting married, let's tell them, sleep around and give them condoms. And Because God said, thou shalt not commit adultery. But if we're making them sleeping around, God going to hate them. Or let's teach them, let's make pork the best day food on the planet. Because God said don't eat no pig. Right. But let's make pork chops in and all that fine stuff and tell them, no, no, no. Oh, shrimp, crab, and lobster. God said don't eat that. Let's make it a delicacy and push it in the black community so black people love them some shrimp and some, some crabs. That's right. Black people love them some pork. But guess what? God said don't eat that. So they in sin. So now God going to curse them because of that. That's why all that evil stuff get pushed to you. Because they understand if you do it, God is going to destroy you. Read. They have taken crafty counsel against thy people. They take crafty counsel against God's people. Read. And consulted against thy hidden ones. Read. They have said, this is what they said. Come. Come on, let, let's all come together. Let us cut them off from being a nation. Let's cut them off from being a race of people. Read. That the name of Israel 
may be no more in remembrance. That they will never Bring remember that they the Israelites. Bring it out. They not going to remember who they are anymore. You know that because if I ask five people what's your race, you might say African American, you might say black, he might say Asiatic black man, she might say bad B, he might say real nigga. We the same race of people, but we got so many different races. Right. Why? And then before we was colored, nigga, Negro, African American, why our race keep changing? That's right. Because it ain't your race. God said, the people came together and said, let's deal with them so that they forget who they are. Right. That their, their name Israel will be no more in remembrance. Right. By who? You. Because they know who you are. But they can't remember who they are. Read. Right. For they have consulted together with one consent. They all in agreement. Read. Right. They are confederate against thee. Right. The tabernacles of Edom. That's the white man according to the Bible. And the Ishmaelite. That's Arabs according to the Bible. Right. Of Moab, that's Chinese people according to the Bible. And the Hagarines, Gibal, uh -huh. and Ammon, that's Japanese people according to the Bible. Really? And Amalek, and, and that's Jewish people according to the Bible. Really? The Philistines, that's Africans according to the Bible. With the inhabitants of Tyre, that's more Africans. So every race of people on the planet is against you. That's why they got stores in your communities and you don't. That's why when you think of projects and hoods, you think of you and not them. Nation is men leading by example. Nation is family. Nation is community. Nation is children with role models. Nation is you.